This is about uncirculated 1979 Roosevelt dime from Koina's collection, where a briefly circulated specimen with potent nickel gray reflectivity on both sides. Eye appeal overall is impaired by several deep gouges and small scratches. Over side of the coin is crisply struck, nowhere is seen on high points of reliefs. Main distractions are these deep gouges on the cheek and behind the ear. Fields display where is seen streaks near the central device, which is most likely result of dye polishing. When we flip it over, we witness massive radial gouging around the central reliefs, abrading some of the letterings as well. It must be the side effect of a coin roll cramping machine. Overall strike of reverse is weak, reverse die must have been significantly deteriorated after large amount of strikes. So no full bands here. Philadelphia means struck over 350 million dimes in 1979. They are pretty common in lower uncirculated grades. Starting from MS66 plus conditions, they become scarce and guiding price goes over $70. In MS67 condition, PCGS certified little over 30 dimes with guiding price of $135. Full bands examples are extremely scarce. PCGS population of full bands specimens are total of just two coins, one in MS65, other in MS66. Sales record was realized in 2018, graded in mean state 65 with full bands. This superb gem with slight touch of champagne and amber hues and sharp strike on reverse ended up selling for $2300 on eBay.